Hi Gemini, welcome back to Omkara Tarot and to your love read. Gemini, let's see how you're feeling now, how the person connected to you is feeling and what action we can expect in this connection. And Gemini, these are general collective readings, may not resonate with all of you. So please keep that in mind. Take what works for you. Leave the rest. So let's begin. Welcome back all my subscribers and welcome in newcomers. All right, so Gemini newcomers, I'm setting down two sets of cards here. One side will be for you, one side will be for your person. And in the center, I'm going to have your dialogue message cards, mutual energies, etc. If this is your reading, Gemini, you'll know which side you resonate best with, right? For me, this is person A, this is going to be person B. Bottom of my deck, nine of wands. Guarded energy, I feel. Uh, I see that somebody is feeling that they lost out on a very, very big cup of love. Maybe feeling rejected right now. Feeling that uh, they know that they are the ones who broke their person's heart. Maybe broke promises and now they've lost out on this love. The other person uh, is feeling, yeah, I never got the offer I expected. I wasn't treated right. I, I feel insulted by them. Uh, this this connection totally backfired. Maybe maybe person B caught them doing something which they shouldn't have been doing. Maybe got betrayed or fe feeling betrayed. So let's see. Let's start with some dialogue message cards here, uh, Gemini. Let's see if you guys could say something to each other. What that would be, and then we'll clarify these. Gemini and their person spirit, if they could say something to each other now, what would that be? Gemini and that person. Gemini and that person spirit. Okay, let's take a few more gems from another deck. Gemini and that person that they're dealing with spirit. If they could say something to each other, what would that be? What do they want to say to each other? Okay, just a few more from a third deck as well. Gemini and that person. Okay. All right, let's do. Let's go. Oh, first card here says, "My feelings for you are now platonic. I see my future with you. I have an addiction. You make me so nervous. Sometimes it's hard to breathe." I feared you were more obsessed with me rather than in love. It felt suffocating sometimes. You made me realize I had flaws. I'm trying to do better now. I bury you with lies. I'm scared to tell you the truth. I'm considering moving on with a soulmate, but I really don't want to have to. I was thinking of you last night. I've told my friends about you. Your presence in my life has turned my world upside down. I still have your pictures on my phone. It's still not over, boo. Okay, so Gemini. Uh, maybe somebody wants to try again i don't know so let's see let's start the reading and figure it out and but before that of course let's do our angel blessing card let's see what my angels have for you today as a blessing guidance advice or a message activist maybe there is some action coming maybe somebody does want to take action here uh, gemini so let's see so spirit, let's start with person A's energy and newcomers. I'm uh, only picking up on two soul energies here. I don't know which side you're on. I don't know whether this is a man here, a woman there. I could also be reading for the same sex couples as well, right? So no gender. And uh, of course, if this is your reading, you'll immediately pick up uh, Gemini, which side you're on. So let's start with person A, focus solely on one side, then we'll move to the other side. So person A, Ace of Cups in Rivers, Ace of, okay, so they pushed away a big cup of love. 
ते फेल या आई लॉस आउट ऑन अ बिग कप ऑफ लव बिकॉज मे बी दिस पर्सन वॉज वर्किंग ऑन देर मनी और वर्किंग ऑन बिकमिंग स्टेबल और दे वॉज जस्ट दे वॉज जस्ट काइंड ऑफ लाइक मनी 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 लेट मी फोकस ऑन माई वर्क एंड मे बी मे बी दे फेल दे वर अ कैच या आई थिंक पर्सन एट वन पॉइंट थॉट दैट दे वर the bees knees and um, they thought that yeah i have it all and let people fight over me let i mean you know they liked people to compete for their attention because they thought they had a lot to offer right so maybe they pushed away that big cup of love which was actually heaven sent for them whoever person a was they never put in the work they they just didn't so knight of cups in reverse now person a yeah now they feeling rejected now they feeling oh my god i had that love i took it and i poured it down now i'm missing that they missing the love that was offered to them feeling very very rejected why is that yeah because now they feeling lonely now they feel left out in the cold they feel abandoned now they're missing that cup of love now their cup runneth dry i mean this king of cups is their cup is totally empty now it's upside down right so is the knight of cups so they could have lost out on multiple people because they were behaving like yeah yeah fight for me fight for me i know i'm a catch so tell me person a you tell me what happened chariot in reverse yeah they did not take action yeah they wanted to be single they wanted to be single this person was sitting in a bit of greedy energy uh, gemini it was like yeah yeah as long as you all fight for me everything works in my favor i don't have to move and take action towards anyone else mm, you know i'll keep my secrets i'll do what i have to do and you know i'm still single independent i don't have to do anything for anyone as long as everybody makes me happy and uh, well the big cup of love that was gifted to them as a soulmate connection came to an end yep they this person was giving to more than one they were bread crumbing here and there and everywhere else and having a 10 of cups in their hand but well the cycle shut down i think am i right yeah yeah this person was a bit rash in their decisions very very rash in their decisions they could have said certain things maybe they were caught lying and cheating and you know doing stuff that they shouldn't have but they thought they could get away with it this person cheated they had they lied they did something there was a card i think which said that right i bury you with lies so person a tell me now that uh, now you're feeling the rejection yeah lot of sadness lot of regret lot of guilt and shame and remorse because now this chapter shut down okay so tell me now how do you see the connection now how do you feel about person b how do you feel about the connection now five of pentacles in reverse they want to come out of the cold yeah this person they still have they they're still hoping i can come out of the cold i hope i can still have a passionate brand new beginning but the problem here is they don't know how they don't know because of all that wrong that they did now they don't know how to make things right justice in reverse yeah they also know that their person is not going to you know accept their bs anymore it's like you know what i've cut you off i'm not going to be one of your options this is what you did to me you treated me like just an option in your life now they know that that person has questions for them what were you doing all this while why did you behave like that why did you lie to me and i'm stronger now your old mind games are no longer going to be tolerated so now they feel even though they have romantic feelings they are not sure whether they will be reciprocated uh, they feel that they've really messed up this one the connection has gone backwards instead of going forward so what action they will take finally i'll open later gemini let's go to the other side and see how person b is feeling so person b you have the queen of pentacles in reverse so well it seems you didn't get the offer or you felt this just yeah they found out something i think person b found out some information which made them feel very very disrespected yeah they caught their partner doing something something which 
I think. Devastated person B. Uh, what's the seven of uh, swords in reverse? What did you find out? Seven of swords in reverse. That uh, this was not stable ground. Uh, they were never, never really coming forward with any kind of an offer. Whatever they said, something or something happened here. Maybe a message came, or or maybe they just kept messaging without exp explanation or never offering anything stable. Uh, whatever I think, person B found out, it broke their heart, big time. Big time. Tell me more, person B. Person B says they they betrayed my trust. They stabbed ten swords into my back home, Karataro. They just left me hurting. And here I was. I used to look at them like they were my king of wands, waiting for them to take action. I respected them. I found them very attractive. But in turn, what did they do to me? They just hurt me. Ten of swords. Yeah, I think person B is kind of given up on them now. It's like, yeah, I'm exhausted. I'm tired. I've tried many times. And they never tried at all. King of wands. King of Wands, King of Wands, yeah, person B feels that uh, they really looked at their partner with respect at one point, but uh, they probably figured out that they were in their shadow energy or the, like this King of Wands was in their shadow energy or had some addictions or mm, was not doing something right. Maybe they found out about their sexual ex expertise or their drinking, I don't know what. But they felt that this connection, this person is just toxic. It's better that I get out of this now or I will get sucked back into something which is unhealthy, an uh, unhealthy dynamic. Yeah, so person B, I think, uh, held back and became stronger in their own right. So you say, I'm going to hold back. I don't want to go towards something which is toxic, towards a person who, you know, okay, so person B, how do you see the connection now? How do you... C person A and how do you see the connection? Two of cups in reverse. Person B says, ah, it's over. We had a great friendship. We thought we knew each other for a long time. Maybe it was, this was a past life soulmate connection. But uh, all they did was make me angry. They made me mad. I'm upset with them. They didn't value this connection. Oh my God, two of cups clarified by the two of cups. So person B is very upset because they truly, I think, at one point believed that this was a strong soulmate connection. They are, they are upset. They are angry. They're upset. Um, they are getting unstuck from the situation. I'm not going to hang, hang around anymore. I'm not going to stress about them anymore. I'm not losing any sleep on them anymore. Because all this time when I was gathering up my strength, Omkara Taro, I found my worth. I'm now the Empress. I'm not going to chase anyone who doesn't want me. I'm not losing any sleep over them anymore. Okay. Yep. All right. So let's see what actions you guys will take. I'm going to take another deck for this one, Gemini. And while I shuffle these cards, may I request you, if you could just tap the like button for me, please. Helps the videos to circulate. Makes me feel happy. So thank you so much. And newcomers, repeating viewers, the ones who haven't subscribed already, it's free for you to do so. Uh, all you have to do is tap the subscribe button and become part of us. We welcome you in. So person A, uh, action from your end towards person B or otherwise. Three of pentacles in reverse, uh, three of cups in reverse. Either they feel that there is no chance of a reunion or maybe they don't want to be in third parties anymore. Let's see. Three of Cups in reverse. What does that mean for you? The world. Oh, they feel there is no chance of a reunion. They feel this cycle is over. This person is sitting in a lot of sadness and regret, looking at the past, feeling this is over. Look at this. This is like weeping. I don't think I, they'll ever agree now, Umkara Taro. They'll never agree to, yeah. They feel that this chapter is shut down now. So does that mean you won't take any action? Or are you just going to sit in sadness and regret looking backwards? Person A, I'm going to give you three more.
the lovers nine of pentacles and the five of cups again yeah so this person feels that uh, their person is uh, or, or maybe they had just they, they just have sadness now sadness feeling lack feeling i never made the choice and i wanted to be single and here i am still single they have a lot of sadness i mean two fives in their action which is like only looking at the past with sadness and regret or maybe they feel the other person is now single and has is the one who can make that choice whether they want to reunite or not they, they've lost their power okay person b let's see what action you will take uh, person b is action towards person a or otherwise person b Person B's action towards person A or otherwise. Seven of uh, Pentacles. I thought as much. I think person B is very disappointed. They really thought this was going to be a true soulmate bond and um, they did respect person A a lot. They did have a lot of uh, adulation, respect, everything, even attraction. I think person B had a lot of attraction and they really wanted person A to take action but there's a sense of disappointment. Yeah, yeah. the person that they thought was going to be the one that they would love forever and offer them something stable turned out to be a player. So person B is disappointed. All right, so that's what I have for you. Till next time then, love and light. Take care. Namaste, Gemini.